Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 on the PS4. This is Gitter Done with That's One Gaming. We are returned to the Avenger to seek out more Advent Forces and put a stop to their global takeover. We want to recover, recover the fate of the world from these vile aliens. Where the heck are we? Where's the event? Oh, the Avengers sitting on satellite. I think. We're trying to unlock this country so we can unlock the next country to be able to get to the black site. Um, here we are, landing. I'll watch Bradford. Hey everybody. Welcome to the resistance. Yada yada yada. Ah, oh, it's just a generic soldier. Never mind. Reading you loud and clear. Alright, so we've unlocked Western Europe. New regional contact located. Which means now we can get a new regional contact in the eastern US, which gets us to a black site, as well as being able to get us to Eastern Europe, which does not get us to a black site. Europe has the all-in which supplies for resistance drops increased by 20%. That's a good deal. We've already got the African quid pro quo which means black items cost 33% less intel which is also good. But in the meantime we're going to make contact with this region with the black site. It's going to take three to five days. Mostly because we need to knock down the Avatar Project. If three more ticks go off on the Avatar Project, we lose. Ooh. So we've constructed the Serpent Suit. Clearly enhances our soldiers' reflexes and speed. Features a grapple mechanism infused with King Viper's Frigid Venom which can be used to pull enemies out of cover and freeze them in place. So we have a serpent suit in our inventory. That's pretty sweet. Ah, crap. We've got to go on a guerrilla ops mission. <sighs> so we've got Western Europe where we can get a scientist. We've got South Africa, which gives us supplies. And East Africa, which gives us an engineer. Informant reduces the retaliation counter by two weeks. Reduces the alien facility counter by two weeks. We can go after the one with supplies and taking care of the Facilities counter, which hopefully will buy us some time to uncover that black site and get the Avatar project knocked down. We've got to put the skull jack on somebody. So we are going to pick this character here, under their loadout. Instead of the frost bomb, I'm gonna get the skull jack. So if we come across an advent officer, we can put that on. Uh, we're going to give this person plus 16 to dodge. And then we've got our frost bomb. Oh, we've got the serpent suit as well. Oh, we are going to put on the serpent suit. I'm not entirely sure how much of this armor is new material and how much of it tag and cut right out of the Viper itself. We haven't exactly tested it either, so good luck out there. <laughs> that is crazy. Huh. <laughs> Crazy serpent suit. He's got like a scarf. 
Looks like a tail. Eee, scarf moves. <laughs> Snakeskin scarf. Or sash, as it were. <laughs> that looks crazy. <laughs> we'll experiment with that. We're going to uh, go ahead and give this person the frost bomb. This is the squad word. Oh no, I didn't want to take. Oh well, we're well, taking the T800. Sky Ranger deploy. In position to drop. We're seeking every possible outlet to gain information on the alien's latest project. And in this case, that means infiltrating one of their facilities to access an exposed terminal connected to their network. Hostile forces will be in position to defend the site, so we'll have to neutralize any threats to lock down the area. Recover whatever you can. We need that data if we're going to stop their progress. Alright, here we go. Our mission is to hack the advent control station. And recover some data information. So we're coming in concealed, which is good. person up into full cover. Hopefully they stay concealed, which they do. Do have some targets up that way. Alright, so goal number one, get, get people done. moved up. Only got eight turns got it. to make it to the target. Advent rolling in. I have what appears to be the sounds of a turret. So that person can see. That person can see. We're going to try and move up. So that person can see. These folks cannot. Should be okay. Johnny Five moved up. He's going to overwatch. Sniper's going to overwatch. This person's going to overwatch. Overwatch here. And we've uncovered a turret. Crapola. This is going to be my last guy. He's going to take the shot on the Viper. And miss miserably. Gun. All right, everybody's revealed. All right, first wave is done. Tiger 
First blade is done. Turret comes online. Somehow, some way, he hits somebody. Move up here. And we uncover more Advent Troopers. Great. We uncovered a lot of Advent things. This is definitely not good. Launch a rocket up here at this turret. Which blows out the bottom, kills the turret. There's absolutely nothing for shots. He has nothing for shots. Move this guy up. See if our shots improve. 8%. Mutan officers, 28%. Red Mutan. And we missed. Fudge sickles. Still no good shots. We've got to take a reload with him. Reloaded. All right, we're just going to overwatch here. Gonna overwatch here. close enough to use this new cool technique. Only got 19% against him. Overwatch. Looks like we're overwatching everybody. That we can. Good lord. Five damage on a sectoid, which is good. Uh, he's resin a guy, which isn't bad. I mean, it's not good, but it's not the worst thing that could happen. This guy is going to... No, 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 don't do it. Don't do it. Come on, miss. Come on. Ah, crap, he's panicked. worked on that guy. Use our revival protocol. Should remove the panic effect. Nice. Nice. We got to take a reload with this character. Remove this guy 
here. Taking a shot. Which misses. Take the slash on this sectoid. Put him down. Right, character out of the way. Can move this character up. He has frost grenade. Won't hit both things, but I'll hit this guy. This guy with a frag grenade. Alright, that gets rid of that. Get this guy moved up here. Just overwatched. Muton's still frozen, which is awesome. Right, he hit that. Newton. Commander, we have confirmation of the exposed access point. All right, we got some stuff. I have the assets. We can take a sniper shot. And we hit. Going to skulljack the officer, which is part of our objective. We have complete access to the admin psionic network. We're just gonna take that hack. It is only a matter of time before they can hack our intrusion. We're good to go. Right, beautiful. Put that guy down. And in drops the codex, which I knew was going to happen. He 
these guys are really frustrating. Hopefully get this guy up here, and yes, we can hack the target, which is good. So, current tech reduced by 50. Yeah, we're going to take that. That sounds like a good thing. So we've got that. Beautiful. Shut it down. We've got some tech. Use a gremlin heal on this character. From the Overwatch. The codex appears to be in a state of flux, existing simultaneously across Shit. multiple dimensions. T eight hundred's gonna reload. Got to got to reload with this guy and get him the heck out of dodge. We need to get this character out of the blast zone of that. Close enough for that. Gonna overwatch. Gonna reload. He doesn't have a shot. We're gonna overwatch here. Take the hundred percent chance to hit. Deal some damage. Thing is gonna clone itself. Ah, dumps the clone right there. God bless it. Can get this person up closer. And still doesn't have a shot, so we're gonna Overwatch. Overwatch with this robot. Ouch. Put one of them down. It's good. One codex dead. The codex is still alive. On the move. Okay, jump. It's only a fifty nine percent chance to hit. Kill right here. <coughs> Beautiful. Both codices are down. X -ray neutralized. Status confirmed. All Mission is done. We are secure. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Excellent work, Commander. It appears some physical remnant of the codex is left behind when it dissipated. Hopefully, it will provide some insight into the alien's ongoing plan. So we had three soldiers wounded. We got an excellent rating though, 12 kills. That was a little bit tougher, but it was good because now we can advance the storyline. Whew. 
back after a good, strong mission. I think we got a couple promotions out of this mission. Yes, ah, three promotions. So the T-800, he's been promoted. So we got Bulwark, gain bonus point armor, high cover to all adjacent squad mates. When overdrive is active, standard shots do not incur recoil penalties. Wow. Hmm. You know what? Let's try Bulwark. What the heck? And this person has the top rank. So, fire twice in a row at an enemy. No. We want Reaper. Reaper allows a melee kill streak, which can be awesome. And this gentleman. Got yeah, Ever Vigilant and Guardian. We're traveling down the Battle Medic. So ever vigilant, if you spend your action on moves, you are granted an automatic overwatch shot at the end of the turn. That sounds good. We'll try that. All right. So those folks are injured. Everybody else is active. Please thank our Got the Codex and Lyrum Core, advanced laser sight, which gives us a 10% improving as as to hit. 163 plot supplies. All right, the Codex reduces the Avatar project by one. So those are good things. Good things, good things. So we got two more days till plated armor comes out. Gonna get on the bridge here. All right, now we're up to uh, down to Four ticks on the Avatar project, which is good. Um, we're not going to investigate the ambush right now. We are going to make contact with this. Oh, we got to make contact with this region first. So the dark event, retaliation counter about two weeks, yada yada yada, that's complete. And we've got a retaliation site. Crap. <coughs> so we've got to stop the advent ret retaliation. We're going to set ourselves up there. And we're going to call this one an episode. Thank you for tuning in, folks. If you've, uh, we're not going to go into the mission. If you've enjoyed the video, please leave a thumbs up. Uh, I need need help with thumbs up and likes and, and even comments. If you like what you're seeing and you, you want to see something else, leave me a comment. Uh, I'd really appreciate it. Thanks again, folks. Have a good one. See you in the next one.